Hello, and welcome to the Jacko Bonds channel, where right now, today, we are ranking the Fortnite medallions. Now, please do not, like, get mad in the comments about anything in this video, because this is my opinion, and just keep it to yourself. Now, you probably know, like, I don't really want to beg for anything, but... Please like and subscribe because I'm a I'm a very small channel and I'd like to gain gain a little bit of traction cuz these videos do take a lot of time. So Now in last place on this list, I think I have to put a medallion that wasn't really that good. And this is the Aries medal. Not to be I guess I don't know, but this medallion just wasn't really that good, but I know people in the comments are going to be saying that it was a good medallion, even though, I mean, you kind of had to be skilled to have it, but most people didn't pick this up because it was usually on the side of the island in Storm, so there was no point in getting it, and it wasn't even that good. All it did was just give a couple damage buffs on like pistols and SMGs. Which is just not good in my opinion, because who carries pistols in Fortnite? I mean, like this season, the Ranger pistol's been pretty bad, and I know that's... And eh, it's not really that controversial, but in my opinion, that's what I think. If I really have to say anything. The Zeus medallion takes an easy 7th place. It's not really that good, but it's not really that bad. It's really mid, but I'm not going to put it at 5th or anything at 6th or anything above 5th or 6th. I'd like to put it at 7th because it deserves that spot. It's not good, but at least we had two m movement medals that season, which was pretty good, but... If there was just one, I would easily pick Cerberus over it. In sixth place, I'm gonna put the original Chapter 5 Season 1 medallions. All of these medallions do the same thing, so there's no point in ranking them all. So I'm gonna rank them all together inside of one slot. In my opinion, these medallions were pretty good, but they don't deserve anything higher than six. Basically, these medallions gave you a shield regen, and the more you had, the time went slow, like, faster, and, um, uh, you could get more shield. So let's say you had all five medallions, you would have a hundred shield in a matter of, let's say, five seconds? Which is pretty good. At this point of the video, most of the medallions that I'm going to rank from five to one are really good and they were very hard to rank. Now I think inside of fifth place, I have to put a medallion that is actually really good, but can't go above fifth place. Now to any Machinist fans, don't get mad, but this is the Machinist medallion. Yeah. Just like the chapter five medallion, uh, chapter five season one medallions, but just like 10% better. So it wasn't exactly that big of a step up, but it was still good. And this medal I usually go for because it's pretty easy to get and plus it's good. Now I think it's safe to say here but the Megalodon Medallion is actually pretty good if you know how to use Nitro. In my opinion, this Medallion is pretty good for running away and fighting against enemies that are low. But it can't get anywhere above, four, above fourth place because there's better Medallions that are coming up. Now this part is probably going to be the most controversial take in this whole video. And a lot of people are probably going to get mad in the comments section. 
because I know how many people like this medallion. But I have to say this right now. I think the Cerberus medallion takes a nice third place. In my opinion, there's better medallions from chapter five and this one just doesn't hit the spot. Around the end of chapter five season two, I just thought this wasn't really good anymore because when the Hades medal got like upgraded, honestly, I would stop dropping at Grim Gates. So this medallion just, I wouldn't go through the hassle to try and get it, in my opinion. I would maybe only go to Grim Gates for the shotgun, which is kind of sad, but this medallion was pretty good when it first came out, and around the end I stopped liking it, but it was still very good, and better than most of the medallions that I've said already. Now I'd like to say right now, the second best medallion in Fortnite has to be the Ringmaster Scar Medallion. This medallion was really good. But the thing is, since so many sweats go for it at the start of the game, it's almost impossible to get. Now, in first place, I think this is easily, in my opinion, easily the Hades Medallion. Inside of Chapter 5 Season 2, I basically needed Siphon, and Siphon was so fun to use and like just getting a kill and then getting hp right after it was amazing i remember getting the siphon medal and i clutched up one of those games and that was just amazing it, it gives you just an amazing feeling while using it so i wish they could bring back siphon in general but this medallion was just amazing now, if you like this video and want more content like this, please consider liking and subscribing because that will really push my channel into the algori algorithm. I can't talk for some reason. Anyways, peace.